So I'm 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 just looking at this uh, Love and Hip Hop trailer, and I'm like, so y'all made me act like I'm just this crazy person, and <laughs> like everything that went on in the show wasn't a cause of Mona's gotten young. Mona, let's just keep it real. I quit the show, so now you want to run back this place that I did three years ago. What you trying to downplay me for? I mean, it's been three, four years since I got into a fight on Love and Hip Hop. I'm a mother. Why would you even try to play those videos that happened four years ago? Like, what's good with you? You mad because you owe me money? And you want some bullshit? Y'all owe me money. You owe me money. Mona, you owe me money. The network owe me money. Now I say she want to do all that shit because I quit. And you want to make it seem like I'm just this crazy person. Okay, so here's the deal. I had to break this up into parts. Basically, your girl, Jocelyn Hernandez, is going off of social media and everything, talking about Mona Scott Young. She allegedly owes her some money and whatnot. I mean, this is just, it's just getting really messy. If you don't know who the lady is with Jocelyn in this picture, that is Stephanie Gale. She's one of the executive producers of Love & Hip Hop Atlanta. And... Man, Jocelyn's looking quite bootylicious, <laughs> bootylicious in this belfy or booty selfie right here. I mean, it's taking up uh, most of the picture. I mean, I know you can barely see the woman in the picture with her. You're like, damn, all I see is ass, you know? <laughs> but anyways, here's some of what Jocelyn Hernandez had to say about her beef with Mona Scott Young on social media. Really? Now, for the record, they, let me say this first. They showed a montage of different clips over the years of John C. Hernandez acting up, wanting to fight people, starting fights, getting into fights and everything on the show, basically making her look like an unruly cast member. And this is her reply. She said, really, the many faces of at Jocelyn? No, the many faces of hashtag Mona Scott Young, hashtag VH1, hashtag NFGTV. Y'all knew Stevie just, I guess she meant to say used to, whoop my ass. You turn your cast against each other. Your producers tell lies and tell us to fight each other. Hashtag Mona, you are the cause of companies not giving young, talented Hispanics and blacks and opportunities because you make us look crazy with your psychologists and master destructive minds of producers working there. Hashtag VH1, hashtag Mona. I will let it be known that you've covered disturbing life events. You throw the ball and them hide. Stop trying to, I guess you meant to say like you throw the ball and hide your hand. Stop trying to use something I've done three to four years ago to make it seem like I'm uncontrollable. You hashtag VH1 and hashtag Mona Scott Young would have never let me executive produce a show for the series of hashtag Love and Hip Hop Atlanta if I was everything you said I was. Now, I will see you in court. Happy 4th. Three peace sign emojis. Click the link on my bio to hashtag be the best you. Hashtag bad bush nation. Hashtag baddest puta. Hashtag baddest puta daily. Hashtag Mona Scott Young. Hashtag love and hip hop Atlanta. Hashtag NFGTV. Hashtag Mona. So there you go. She says, see you in court, Jesus. She's talking about suing people now. This is getting really ridiculous. Jocelyn, don't ever ruin your pretty. You're too pretty for all this nonsense. You know. I just, I, this is just a sad situation. I just feel so bad, you know. I don't like seeing my pretty girls in distress. It makes me want to throw my cape on and play cap to save a pretty girl, you know. But anyways, that's my superhero alter ego. Oops, I don't reveal my secrets. Anyways, let me know what y'all think about it all below. Subscribe to the Meat Magazine YouTube channels. Visit Meat Magazine, not blogspot.com for more. Follow me on Twitter at Meat Magazine. Meat Magazine 7 on Google Plus. Meat Magazine blog and Instagram. Hit the notification button to be sent alerts to be notified when new videos get posted. Do you think she has a case here or do you think she's going to lose in court? Do you think it's a waste of her time? Who do you think is going to win? Mona or Jocelyn at the end of the day? Or do you think they're both going to win? I say they're both going to come out looking pretty good because, you know, they're both very successful, beautiful ladies and, you know, they're both very intelligent. So I, I can see them both winning at the end of the day. Is Stephanie Gill single? Let me know in the comments.